This week's video is going to be something that I have experienced all this week. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It feels amazing to see y'all again. Hope y'all had a great and productive week and you conquered it like a boss. Now, this week was not very, I would say, was not a very good week that I had. But I would say it was a very productive week though. Now, I'm sure you all are like, wait, what happened in your week that might, why you want to say that it's not so good? Well, actually, to be honest, I had a very frustrating week. And as a result of that frustration, I find myself very unhappy at times. And there are also a couple of incidents that happened that made me realize a lot of things that I should be grateful and thankful for. And as a result, I, at the end of the week, as in today, and tomorrow probably I might do another reflection, but today I feel so much better and so much more inspired. That is why I decided to do a video. Frustration is that feeling you get when you want to do something, but for some reason, you are your own obstacle stopping you from doing whatever you want to do so as a result you get and your confidence level goes down you are you have you look like you had practically the worst day in your entire life that is called frustration now frustration is something that we all can never run away from actually i was very frustrated due to a certain people and I, as a result, I found myself being frustrated and negative and not confident and all those emotions that I don't like feeling. And I found myself being very not myself. That was basically it. I'm not going to pinpoint fingers or I'm not going to bash them in, that, in this video. I'm going to tell you guys what I learned from this week from being frustrated and what it has done to me. So. What I feel I have learned, not I feel, what I know I have learned from being frustrated is that it hinders your productivity. I know this week if I wasn't frustrated, I definitely would have been 10 times more productive than what I was. And we are in charge of how we feel and the emotions that we exude. So I decided midweek that I don't want to be frustrated and that I want to do work. I want to get work done and I want to work on my channel and I want to work on, I want to do my best for my internship because it was my final weeks of my, final days of my internship and that I want to give it my all, my last 110% before I left Calix. But because I was frustrated, I couldn't give my 110%. I would say I gave like 90, 95, 98%. But here's the thing I need to want to point out to you guys. Don't make the mistake that I made last week. Because frustration is something that you can take out very easily on things. Like for example, you can channel your frustration to your work. And instead of putting it out as negative energy and complaining, you can just channel that energy into your work. And I know your work won't be 100% effective, but it will be better than you sitting down and complaining and not doing any work at all. Trust me guys, it's true. But one thing that you should do a lot is talking to yourself because no one knows you more than you do. Not your parents, not your friends. I know there are people who claim that they know us better than we do, but trust me, nobody knows you better than you do. So the only way to keep in tune with yourself is to have conversations with yourself. When you are sitting alone in a room and talking to yourself, it's in your hands to help the one person in that room that is you. I hope you guys get the message that I'm trying to convey through this video. I here I sit today telling you guys that frustration is something very common, but it is easily overcomable if that's a word and if you all never watched my video last week click this i button right here it was the first time i went live on facebook and it was very exciting actually but the live stream ended up being 18 minutes long 
but worry not i will post a condensed version of this video on my facebook page so if you haven't liked my facebook page yet jump on to facebook and hit that like button because i am going to post a condensed version of my live stream which i get very emotional and sentimental and tell you guys the true reason why i started this channel so i will see you guys again next week don't forget to hit that subscribe button because I make new videos every Saturday and you guys don't want to miss out. Hit that bell icon so that you know when I upload new videos. And be sure to comment below with those questions that you guys want me to clear your doubts. Or you guys have any questions related to anything at all. Please comment them down below. I will respond to all of those comments. And give, as per usual, give this video a big fat thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you again next Saturday. Sending you lots of love and positivity. Mwah.